Hi, today I will discuss about uh, how to solve this beam, I section beam in MATLAB. So let's go to the question. Uh, they say that this uh, I beam has 48 inch length. Uh, this is the flange width and this is flange thickness. This is uh, this is uh, 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 wipe thickness, wipe thickness and wipe height. <clears throat> so let's go. What they want? Uh, they want the transfer shear at point A. Point A is here, and the maximum horizontal shear in the globe, wipe and flange of the shear, and using two different approach. So let's go in the uh, main scripts file. So I define this uh, this is this image as image uh, cover to say here. So I unlock it and keep it in here. And when I run it, uh, these all the thing came in here. I QA, QB and maximum share. So let's talk about this thing. <clears throat> So I define uh, the variables in here, uh, flange thickness, flange width, and wipe thickness in here. And uh, there I define the maximum shear. So uh, in the question, you say that the wipe length is 48 inch, and there is a uniformly distributed load, 5 kip per inch. So uh, if I multiply it, 5 multiply 48 and divided by 2 this will give me a 2 inch share so I divided it here 48 into 4 so uh, sorry it will be 5 48 multiply 5 5 okay and then moment of inertia uh, is like that bhq by 12 so for uh, web I take it uh, B this is B H cube by 12 plus and this is for flange uh, the B is 6 and H cube is 1.5 B H cube by 12 plus and I give a D square so area is 6 and uh, multiply 1.5 and D square means uh, from neutral axis to this neutral axis distance so it will be uh, this thickness divided by half this will give the flange uh, cent uh, center of gravity uh, mal uh, plus h by 2 the admin h by 2 means this thing so this will give this height this is d and then uh, first moment of area so first moment of area means mainly it is <clears throat> the area and uh, upper the upper the neutral axis or lower the neutral axis so i take in here the upper upper the uh, neutral axis so uh, the formula is that area this area multiply the uh, neutral neutral axis distance so area is uh, this width and thickness multiply uh, this uh, this height plus t, tf by 2 that means this height to neutral axis and maximum share at joint uh, in the question they asked about maximum share joints between the wave and plans so maximum share at joint uh, it is it is uh, maximum shear formula is b b q that means shear into uh, this first moment of area uh, divided by moment of inertia into width so uh, this width is this uh, flange width shear at blue joint and then uh, shear the maximum shear occurs on neutral axis uh, they also find the maximum 
horizontal shear is in the glue joints between the wave and flange and uh, uh, maximum shear in the in the uh, in the wave it it will occur in the neutral axis so i take qb again it is uh, flange area flange area in multiplies neutral axis distance plus width uh, wave width into uh, its neutral axis distance so again maximum share in, in, in by this equation and then the output so i give it output a print f maximum share stage this digit give you uh, how much you want how many digit you want so like here if you give 0.3 that means it will goes uh, after 0.33 digits if you put two here then it will go two digit and f means print and and give you a new new line and it will print share max join this these variables and similarly the next line it will print share max so let's run it so you see i change here point to it it gives 0 0.02 and uh, and uh, it gives it prints the pictures as well pictures in here so i unlock it okay okay this is so in this way you can solve i beam just uh, if you change this flange weight and uh, wipe weight and just make some share then you you can uh, you can change all the thing so thank you for watch for watching my video if you like the video please subscribe my channel okay